This is the unlikely story of the Bale brothers. Gareth and Kenneth Bale were born in the country of Wales, in the Whale Hospital. It was at this very early stage that the parents were told that the baby in pink would go on to become an elite footballer. And so the parents knew they didn't have enough money for two children if one of them was meant to become a future star. They were left with no other choice. Young Kenneth was shipped across the pond to Ireland via Royal Whale. Kenneth attended the Irish School for Ex-Wales, where he exceeded in all classroom studies. Gareth Bale wannabe? You have any fucking idea what this animal is here? It's a fucking whale, you basic bitch. So you wanna buy packs, but you got no coins, and you wanna pack bail, but you hate FIFA points, and you wanna beat your brother with a super fly team, but your coin total zero, so it's basically a dream. You FIFA is the answer to your question. Cheap and reliable, the best on the net here. ZWB for 8% off. Stack them coins and load your squad up. Oh, this is Kitsu. Mango Passion Fruit Kitsel. AKA Fanta Kitsel. <laughs> What's happening boys and welcome to the Young Bill aka the Mick Bale episode here. When I got the tweet from someone to take a look at a picture of a guy who plays for Spurs named Kenneth McAvoy, this is what I saw. Look at this guy's face! That is fucking Gareth Bale! How does he also play for Spurs? That's crazy! But anyway boys, we are looking at this Irish Bale named Kenneth McAvoy, plays for Spurs, he's incredibly young, I believe he is 20 years old, and we've got a few of his stats right here. But anyway, we've got 87 acceleration, 84 agility, 80 balance, 87 pace, and that's where the good stuff ends. Literally all of his other stats, except for dribbling, is red. <laughs> 52 finishing, 56... What's BC? Ball control. He's got 56 ball control. But he also has 4-star weak foot and 3-star skill moves, which is kind of surprising. 4-star weak foot for a 56 overall bronze player. I suppose that's not that crazy, but it's still pretty crazy. We have dropped him into a squad with his Spurs teammate, Ericsson, a.k.a. the FIFA Viking, the most recent FIFA Viking. And then we've got his brother, or his dad, whatever the hell, more likely his brother, freaking Gareth Bale. Got Alan Pardew in there, up to 106% smack my bitch up bonus. If you guys want to give me some suggestions of some other young players I could do, let me know in the comment section below. Let me know if you guys are enjoying this video. Let's aim for maybe 40 likes. We can maybe hit that target. Instagram and Twitter links are in the description below if you guys want to interact with me there. But this squad, I know I say that all the time, but this looks like one of the more interesting squads I could ever use. Let's freaking get into a match. Los kids. Like, this is a great squad. This is a great squad. But I'm just trying to put myself in the position of the guy that I'm playing right now who's wondering to himself, is that Irish guy actually Gareth Bale or is he a relative? Did his mom sleep around with the mailman? Oh, oh, oh my god! Wait. Wait a second. Who's celebrating that? Who is that? Wait, wait a second. Please tell me that's not McAvoy. I can't tell, is that Bale or McAvoy? What the hell was that? It's a dick goal. When I think of the moist, I think of a sweaty sack. It's a fucking dick goal! It went off Gareth Bale's dick! What, <laughs> what the hell, bro? I've never seen a dick goal in my entire life. Holy shit, and there's McAvoy right there. I can't tell. I can't wait to see his in-game picture to see if he actually looks like Bale. Bruce? Nah. Nah. <laughs> no! A 56 overall bronze player just cut through two goals. Who's that defender? Who's that defender that just let the Irish bail in between? And then he megs him between the legs. No! This... Like, this game could not have started any sweeter. Lloris. What? What a save! What a save from Lloris. Holy smokes. Oh, just beautiful stuff. Oh! Holy shit. Ref. Alright. Relax. Relax, bros. We got this. For those of you wondering what 56 ball control looks like, that's what it is right there. <laughs> By the way, McAvoy is on 6 chem, uh, cause I went with the, uh, Premier League Manager League with Pardew, or AKA Smack It Up. Whoa! And then, uh, Gareth Bale's on 5 chem. 7 shots, 4 on target, almost 60% possession, and we have a goal with McAvoy. A more legit goal with McAvoy than we do with Bale, to be honest with you. Let's get in the second half, let's see if one of them get a hat trick. So I'm about halfway through with my Fanta Kitzel, so I need to ration it, cause there's nothing worse. 
than starting the second half, and I, I'm guilty of this all the time, and I'm done with my beverage, like, halfway through the, uh, the episode. Oh, God. Oh, God! Oh, my God. Did you get to beat him again? Oh! Shit. Shit. I was just talking shit a second ago. And now he's gonna watch every replay. <laughs> my hands actually smell amazing. Oh my god. Oh my god! 12 shots, 7 on target. Oh my god, he fucking hell. How did I lose that match? Anyway guys, hopefully you enjoyed the episode. I needed a couple minutes to chill out. I had to have a couple sips of my Fanta Skate, so... Pretty amazing goal with uh, 56 overall bronze card with McAvoy there, aka Young Bale. And then uh, the goal from Cruz, the dick goal from Cruz to Bale was just unreal. If you guys did enjoy the episode, hit that like button as well. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button down below. I will see you guys for another upload tomorrow. Thank you so much for the support recently, guys. I really, really appreciate it. I'm in the Middle East right now. I'm in Lebanon for 10 days for uh, a wedding and just a general vacation. So um, I, I couldn't be doing, I couldn't go away for that for 10 days without you guys. So from the bottom of my heart, thank you so, so much. And it means the absolute world. Like I said just a few seconds ago, I'll see you for another upload tomorrow. Till next time, boys. Tschüss. Later. Adeus.